pieces. So that's where I'm at. Um, so I was asked to kind of um, introduce, but at the same time conclude um, this virtual collaboration. Um, and so I wrote a little speech kind of poetic, um, which is titled um, Our Sense of Place. And I think the special thing about this project um, is that we're all sitting in different places. So our sense of place um, and where we are um, for the first time in a long time can be malleable and we can kind of break those barriers. So. And here we go. As I reflect on this process, I have realized that I am sitting in my classroom, surrounded by the walls of the Cortez community. You are all sitting in your own place. You're sitting in a classroom, you're sitting in a living room, maybe a bedroom or a home office, or maybe even a kitchen table. We all have our own sense of place, yet we have come together for a virtual collaboration that has encouraged us to redefine that sense of place. We all define ourselves by our home and our origin place that shapes who we are. Yet right now, I find myself reflecting and redefining this sense of place. That's what's special about life, don't you think? We have the opportunity to redefine how we see ourselves in the world and how we navigate it. We have the opportunity to reconnect with place and time. And this project has been a catalyst for my reflection and how I work within my walls. This virtual collaboration broke the barriers of our sense of place. We worked with over 40 students across the state with 10 dynamic and incredibly adaptable teachers and dozens of water-minded mentors. We all came together to redefine how we learn and how we see our sense of place. We learned that collaboration can be endless with passionate-minded people and that technology can even bind us all together. We were able to navigate new tools and embark upon the unknown. I mean, humans have been navigating uncharted territory for all of our existence. So this bridge that brought us all together was a simple idea about something that inevitably binds us all together. And that idea was water. Water can teach us how to be gentle and nourishing, yet strong and powerful. What a beautiful balance that can bring us all together. Thank you to everyone who managed this balance and help us bridge a new sense of place. We are only just beginning and our solutions can be endless. So get out there and make positive change, break the barriers and break down those walls and redefine your sense of place. And so that, you know, that I've been thinking about this sense of place and how we are in Ignacio to Stratton, we're all the way into Denver and Callahan and Manzanola, like we are all over the state of Colorado, sharing this, sharing this uh, place on Zoom. And who would have thought that we were able to collaborate using technology, which usually breaks people apart, um, but we're together in this adventure. And I am so excited that my students are here. Um, my mom is actually here on this meeting um, and thinking about all of the mentors um, that have given up their time um, to answer questions for students. Um, I've been talking to my students a lot lately about how adults are powerful. We have a lot of say in the world, but when we want solutions and we want things to actually change and we want positive impacts, kids and youth, you guys are the ones that actually are gonna make change. So when Greg says that this is only just the beginning, believe him, it's true. Um, this is just the beginning. We have each other's contacts and we can reach out because we have broken the barriers and redefined our sense of place. Um, so I'm like bursting with excitement and joy. I'm so excited to hear the reflections. Um, but more importantly, I'm looking at teachers and um, it hasn't been easy, but I think Greg had a, um, he had a special place for us and we were his students. And I think that we were able to learn um, and adapt more than we ever thought we could. Um, so props to us, um, but more props to our students. Um, this is all because of you. Um, and I hope that you guys continue with this mission and you guys continue with these questions. Um, and the cool thing is Google Drive folder, um, it's never gonna go away. So that is a resource for all of us um, for however Google is in existence. So uh, that was my intro as well as a conclusion, but um, 
we um, we're embarking on a new adventure and I, I just am so excited that we were able to do this. So thank you, Greg. Thank you, Anne. Um, and thank you mentors for giving up time and all the teachers. So big props to us. <laughs> for those reaction buttons for sure. This is so cool. Brittany, thank you. That was amazing. Amazing. I, I can't thank you enough for that.